This demo illustrates the use of RPA TaskBots for automating accounts payable process end-to-end. -end. Since reading invoices, extracting its data and converting it into a structured form is the most challenging part of such automation, we will review it first. We start with IQBot training, which is based on assisted machine learning. User initiates the training by selecting domain, invoices, selecting recognition language and the fields to extract and uploading sample documents. IQBot automatically reads, classifies documents and takes a first pass on data extraction based on existing domain knowledge. User reviews the results and submits corrections, which are used by IQBot for self-training. User creates a new learning instance, gives it a name, invoice training, selects domain, invoices, selects language, English, and uploads sample documents. User also checks the set of fields to extract and the list of line item fields. After clicking on Create Instance and Analyze, IQBot leverages AI to start grouping invoices based on their formats and extracting data. When the first document is ready for review, user can start training. As we can see, invoice number was found correctly, as well as invoice date. However, total would require some training. So we click on Grand Total Label and IQBot picks the value up automatically. For payment terms, IQBot has found label, but not the value, so we mark the area where value is located. Subtotal was picked correctly. Now we train line items table extraction. First, we need to select the end of table indicator, which in our case is subtotal field. Then we check table column titles, description, quantity, and amount and switch to Review Screen. Here we can see that after training, all the fields were extracted correctly. We save the trained IQBot and ready to use it in processing. Now let us see how the newly trained IQBot will work with RPA bots to automate process end-to-end. -end. First step is preparing invoices. RPA bot collects email attachments into one folder and another RPA bot uploads them into Cognitive IQBot. IQBot extracts data from invoices and after validation, saves it to CSV file. If some data fields don't pass validation, they will be reviewed by a human operator and these corrections will be used as additional training data. Here is RPA Enterprise Client Interface, which is used to run RPA bots. The first bot we run collects email attachments and saves them. Next bot uploads invoices to IQBot. Then, IQBot extracts data from the invoice, field by field, including line items, and saves it in structured format to CSV file. Then, another RPA bot takes this structured data and uploads it to SAP. Bot logs into the system using credentials. creates a new invoice record and fills out the fields with the data from CSV file. And after running internal checks, such as PO matching, we are ready to submit payment. Now let us see what happens with exceptions. In this example, invoice date field is contains an extra dot, which needs to be removed. When user corrects and saves the document, the machine learning in IQBot leverages this corrected data for additional training. Now, in case of similar error, IQBot automatically suggests the correction. IQBot Advanced Analytics includes tracking of straight-through processing parameter, as well as graphical representation of training quality. As you may see on this chart, while IQBot keeps learning from processing more documents over time, it results in constant increase in straight-through processing. This chart shows the number of samples used for training a particular data fields. Tall green columns represent well-trained fields, which could be extracted with high confidence, while yellow and red fields require additional training. The same data represented in flat circles for one document allows us to create a 3D model for multiple documents, where each of them represented by a blue bubble surrounded by multiple green, yellow, and red bubbles data fields. Some fields could belong to more than one document, 
which allows cross-checking data from multiple documents in a single document set. For example, Mortgage Application Package has many documents with the same applicant's name, address, and other information, which could be matched and validated automatically, increasing STP even further. You may find more information and request a product demo at www.automationanywhere.com.